Hey, so what's going on guys? Make it with Drug Tech Reviews and welcome back to another video. So this video is going to be a pretty quick one, but it's something that I believe many of you guys will actually be interested in, especially if you are really invested in the MagSafe ecosystem. So right here, I have the Catalyst Total Protection, which I really love and I've been using this as my daily case for the past months ever since I reviewed it. So I wanted to add on the missing feature on this case which is MagSafe. So I went online actually went through a couple of brands which had MagSafe adapters I should say is like a adapter sort of a adhesive uh, add-on to any case to make it MagSafe compatible. But after going through so many brands I picked the one I have right here which is from Chabi. So I will leave the link in the description if you're interested. Of course, they did not sponsor this video. I actually purchased it with my own money. I did hear like mixed bag of reviews from uh, different people who have purchased this, but uh, I hope that it will work out for this case. So with all adhesive materials, uh, of course, the surface that is stuck on is very important. Uh, however, the one on the total protection is actually sort of a matte texture so i'm not sure how well it's going to stick on to the back of this but fingers crossed that it will work because i use the pitaka mac easy come out pro as my daily car charger in my car and this case not having mac safe is actually making things pretty inconvenient because i actually use apps like waze and uh, spotify and on and i like to have my phone propped up right in front where it's in my line of sight so the good thing about this is that it also works with any wireless charging phone so any phone that has the wireless charging function you can actually stick this on and be able to use MagSafe. all right so what came in the package is basically these two pairs of stickers a gift card but i wish they also included a microfiber cloth and also some alcohol prep pads because you do want to clean the surface down uh, thoroughly before you stick this on yeah you have uh, two chances but both are in different colors so that's the reason why i bought two sets so just in case i mess up the black one i do have another one right there let's open the package and see how this looks like so this is actually the first time opening it okay let's take out all the package contents okay so we have a black one right here really thin and it's a 3m backing so that's a good thing because 3m always just works so we also have a small little card this is orbit metal ring I'm not sure what this is for but i'll figure this out so you can uh, take a closer look i can't see this right now because i'm behind the camera so you have two of this along with another silver colored magnetic ring so this is called the orbit metal ring they do have a uh, pretty nice products on their website okay so let's uh, get on with the installation of this chubby orbit metal ring so i do have my case right here i'm going to clean it off with the alcohol prep pad so this is one of the extras that I had laying around. So I'm just going to give it a nice wipe down. So it's usually around the Apple logo. So it's right smack in the center of the Apple logo. So one thing to note is that you do have to stick it outside the case. If you are planning to stick it inside the case, unless it's a super thin case like the one from Pitaka. Yeah, then it will work from the inside. But I did like test it on this case from the inside, of course. It didn't fit that well because it's a waterproof case and the tolerances are very slim but it's also to ensure that the magnets have the most amount of grip because you do not want your phone to go flying out while you're using it so now that's done let's grab the microfiber cloth and start cleaning off the back okay that should be good enough okay so after reading the instruction i realized you do have to stick this onto your case before you install the metal ring so it's actually Interesting that they provided this because you can actually stick it to any case material, even a silicone case. So if you do use it on a silicone case or something like a ruffle material like this, just to take precaution and get the maximum strength from the adhesive, you do have to paste this on first and then stick the metal ring. But now the problem is, is that I do need to align the magnet perfectly. Uh, something like this. So yeah, let's uh, figure this out together.
Alright guys, so actually installing was a pretty difficult task because I couldn't get the exact alignment for the magnets on the phone itself so I was like uh, doing some gas work and actually taking my gel pen and drawing some marks so I can actually roughly gauge where the center is but anyways finally I got it like stuck on I believe this is as close as I can get you can see right here is uh, pretty nice overall uh, they have the adhesive on the inside which is pretty good so it won't damage the case if I do plan to sell this case later on but overall um, not the easiest install but it definitely did the trick by placing some markers around okay so now I got my MagSafe park right here let's try out MagSafe and see whether it works so moment of truth you can see right here that it is charging up let me bring it closer to the camera see that it's charging which means that this is actually working and I'm really really stoked on uh, uh, having MagSafe back this case of course is not a MagSafe case and this MagSafe ring doesn't make it MagSafe compliant but it just allows the phone to be attached to different MagSafe accessories which is fantastic especially if you use it in the car a lot like how I use my phone all right so uh, this has been a pretty quick video of course I wish they actually included uh, some sort of alignment tool okay so if you're interested in this product i'll definitely leave the link in the description below and uh, of course the price is pretty reasonable i believe a pair for less than 10 ringgit so i think this is a pretty affordable accessory and overall i think it works uh, of course some of the other china ones uh, you do have the option to add on a ruler which you can actually align but this does not have so i wish they improved it in that department but overall if you do uh, align it properly it works really really no issues at all so the magnet really holds on just like the actual phone itself all right so uh, this has been a pretty quick video hope you guys like it if you did like it do hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to the channel for more content just like this one and i'll see you guys in the next video